experts behind the line. Three, two, one, crescendo. Off we go in auto. Racing to the center of the field. Bees beats TJ, but TJ gets the note, which is the important part of the race. Killer Bees get the next one. Here comes Petty getting two notes off that center line. Big lead for Blue, 46-21 as drivers take control. Lions scoring quickly down into that blue amp. TJ setting up the feed up and over the stage to their Alliance partners. Shooting, scoring. Boston Lions ready to go again. They shoot, they score, no. It pops right back out. Red Alliance, their first amplification brings them to 35. Blue Alliance is at 60. Red is ready for amplification number two, and it's the Bees shooting, scoring. One, two, high tide helps them out from the wing line. And that amplification period ends. Now Blue Alliance turn. Can they spread that lead? 77 for blue. And the amplification ends, 59 for red. 19 point advantage, one minute 10 left in this match. Here comes Bees. They've got a stockpile of notes to choose from. They've got an amplified speaker. 75 is red's score as Blue Alliance takes over an amplified speaker as well, 99 to 77, with 45 seconds left. Red amps again. Two in the amp for the Bees. Blue Alliance amplifies, trying to play through the defense. High tide, sitting. Now sitting motionless in front of that blue Subwoofer. Blue Alliance has been playing this last part of this match, three versus two, and it's showing on the scoreboard, 125 to 104. Under 10 seconds. Up goes TJ, down goes the note. Trap for the Red Alliance, up in the air is Petty. Will they hold it? We'll have to see. Blue Alliance with the victory, 151. Huge score to 117. So Blue Alliance gets to maintain that comfy track through the upper bracket. We'll see them next in round four match.